All right, gonna do a video about these insane rallies outside the courthouse where Kyle Rittenhouse is being tried and uh, will be obviously seen as not guilty because he is not guilty. Just a foretelling right there, a prophetic foretelling. No, I'm not a prophet, so don't don't call me a prophet. I'm not one, but I do believe he will be non guilty. And by the way, I'm not falling for this whole left left right paradigm. Okay, I will. I know that the left wing and the right wing are both, you know, part of that paradigm. I'm just speaking the truth. Okay, the truth is that Kyle Rittenhouse is not guilty. Okay, I'm not right wing. I'm not left wing. I'm neither one. Okay, I'm just a Bible believing Christian. But Kyle Rittenhouse is not guilty. And some of these. Uh, rioters and protesters outside the outside the courthouse are just nuts plain and simple there's no nice way to put it they're nuts and they do not know the facts they don't do the research for themselves let's check out this video right here uh gonna turn up the volume a little bit make sure because these people do not do their own research they just believe whatever the the illuminati jesuit ran media tells them so this they're saying oh i say a convict killer kyle uh what about all the, the black men who kill all their black men what about convict them you see this is the thing about black lives matter and this may make people some some people upset but quite frankly i don't really care you know what the biggest killer of black men is other black men plain and simple you know what the other biggest killer of black men is abortion how come blm's not protesting black on black violence you know and not to mention too both his victims are white people we seem to forget that Ridiculous, nutty, ridiculous insanity from social liberalism. Liberalism is a cult, by the way. And again, no, I'm not right wing, I'm not left wing, I'm neither one. But I see that liberalism is clearly a satanic cult. He came down because he was requested to come down. He was down here fleeing graffiti. He was and, and just heads up, there is going to be a bit of profanity. Just uh, heads up, a warning. Trying to help people, he and he was a pet. Oh, oh! Look what she says. He wasn't helping nothing. Uh, did you actually watch the photos and see the video, or do you just believe, just eat up whatever the media tells you? He was cleaning up graffiti that you BLM thugs, you BLM Satanists, go around. He's putting out fires that you BLM Antifa Satanists put. Now that may be too real for some people to take, but that's just a blunt and brutal reality. He was helping people, and you from you BLM Antifa Satanists out there. You need to get saved and get right with God. Um, he wasn't killing them. They attacked him. They tried to kill him, and he shot them in self-defense. How would you actually do your own research instead of believe whatever the, the media tells you? How about you actually? How about you try being in that situation? You know, bunch of of Satanists over at BLM, bunch of of lunatic witches and sorcerers and devil possessed lunatics over at BLM and Antifa don't even actually they, they want always want to cry victim bunch of wicked devils he came down to protect the property the yes he did he came yeah. down man they got in my video he's cleaning goddamn graffiti and every damn thing else he's got an air a fire extinguisher to put up out the fires he uh where's the other part oh, the other video I wanted to show here here's a funny part right here Boys. but it's okay we defend them right Huber? Oh, I care about the pedo Huber is left-handed now! Huber is left-handed now! Huber is left-handed now! <laughs> <laughs> Lol, that is kind of funny, actually. Where's all the triggers, folks? All the aids are bastards! All the aids are bastards! Abolish the police! Except for the ones that arrested Kyle Rittenhouse. Abolish the prisons! Except for Kyle Rittenhouse. <laughs> Again, that's a good point. That's, that's the funny thing about the hypocrisy of BLM and Antifa. Oh, we need to abolish the police. Except when we need the police. You know? Double standards at its finest. But, of course, BLM and Antifa, they're, they're specialists at double standards. Social liberalism in general is quality. If you want to get into double standards, just be a social liberal. You'll be the you'll be the king or queen of double standards. Your your messages are confusing, BLM. Do you support black lives or do you support pedophiles? 
Yeah, that's another thing the media seemed to leave out, and, and a lot of these BLM Antifa Satanists seem to leave out, is that, is that one of the victims was a stinking pedophile. A stinking person who went out and touched little kids. But oh, he's a victim somehow. Ridiculous. Turbo maps, how oh, they're called. Maps. Can you believe that? A, a, a pronoun for your pedophile. Anthony Don't forget about all. Anthony Jojo. And Jojo don't get it. Shut it down. <laughs> Shut what down? Huh? Shut down shooting a convicted pedophile? Is, do you realize these people are defending a pedophile? Do these people even have a brain? Do they even think properly? Well, I guess if you're part of the Antifa or BLM, you probably don't think properly. Plain and simple. Insanity. They're defending a pedophile. They probably didn't even watch the video. Okay? When you're hit over the head with a skateboard, when you have a gun pointed at you, uh, you're going to act in self-defense. Try being in his situation and not burning down cities for once. Because these guys, these idiots, seem to they want to just burn down cities and start fires and burn down businesses and not expect any repercussions. That's, that's plain and simple. That may be too real for you to take if you're BLM or Antifa, but that's the blunt and brutal reality. You can like it or lump it. Uh, full screen again. Unlike Oops. QuickBooks, NetSuite was built for multinational, multi-subsidiary companies. Automate what, what are you trying to do here? I'm trying to prove that eight years of Obama telling us that white nationalists are our problem, I, I don't see it. Yeah, Obama was definitely a, a high-level Luciferian Illuminati Jesuit puppet. Plain and simple, Obama was a, was a very wicked guy. Uh, high level Luciferian. He worked for, he, he was, he was a, just a, a pawn for the Pope in Rome, for Satan, for his father Satan, plain and simple. Uh, but yeah, Obama was definitely a detriment for America. He, he was just, he was probably the most anti white president in U.S. history, if anything like that. I mean, probably the worst president in U.S. history, if anything, in terms of, of race relations. But anyway, continuing, go further on in the video. Claims. To be behind God is really. What's what that one knucklehead up there say that a skateboard isn't a lethal weapon? Get hit over the head with a skateboard. It, a skateboard can hold me and I'm 300 freaking pounds. Let somebody pound you over the head with a skateboard and see if it's a deadly weapon. It's so stupid. Think of it this way too. Who do they charge? They charge the kid who's trying to stop the rioters. Why were the police told to stand down by the governor? That's a great He was point. doing the job that the police were supposed to do, but were told they That's couldn't. That's a great point. Stop white supremacy! Stop white supremacy! Okay, look, look here, here's the idiocy of all this. Look at that. I'm gonna do full screen. They're showing two pictures of white people while claiming uh, killed while standing up for black lives and saying stop white supremacy. They're both white guys. This is the idiocy of all this. It's white supremacy against other white people? Huh? Are, are, are our brains screwed on properly? Or are we just totally nuts? Which I think is probably the more likely case. And again, they completely ignore the facts of what of the kind of wicked devils these two people were. One of them was a pedophile, one of them was other, they both were convicted criminals, and they both attacked Rittenhouse first. One of them pulled a gun out on him. One of them one of these other attackers hit him in the head with a skateboard. They could just completely ignore, ignore the facts. We all know it's there. We all know it's there, yet we don't do anything about it until now. We're going to make a difference in this world before the, the, the world takes us as well. They did not deserve to die. No one deserves to die. Yet they did that night. My sister knew one of them. She met him that day. He wasn't doing anything wrong. Anthony Huber was not a bad guy. He was not a bad guy. So you mean the, both these men, the wicked devils? One was a convicted pedophile, the other was were both criminals? They're not bad people, right? So pulling a gun out on somebody, hitting them in the head, chasing them, attacking them is not bad? Bunch of, of Luciferian lunacy. Just like, the, uh, just like Jacob Blake and just like Jojo, yet he got hurt, yet he suffered consequences for something hurt, standing up for what he believes in. Can you imagine that? Standing for what he believes in. Yeah, hitting a kid over head with a skateboard, pulling a gun out on him, coming up behind him and punching him and attacking him and chasing him around. Yeah, standing up for what you believe in. But coming from people who burn down cities as a form of protest, this doesn't come as much of a surprise. Now that's too real for some people to take, but that doesn't bother me one bit. Here's the next video I'm going to show. 
of this whole insanity, this, this nutty lunacy. This loose this Luciferian lunacy, that's what I'm gonna call it. Luciferian lunacy. We do not need agitators. We do not need instigators. Agitators? You mean like the people who are burning down cities all summer long during 2020, who are setting shops on fire, attacking people, burning down businesses, destroying cities, just destroying their neighborhoods, destroying everything? Oh, but we don't need agitators. Huh? Bunch of, bunch of Luciferian liberal doublespeak right there. We do not need Oops, let me full screen. Individuals that are going to bring a spirit of violence and conflict at a time when we're seeking justice. <laughs> oh, oh, a spirit of violence and, and conflict. You mean like burning down cities all summer long? You mean like rioting for like pretty much the entire summer? Yeah, definitely a spirit of violence right there. You see, everything that they're guilty of, they're projecting on the bad old white kid. You know, anti-white racism is a very big problem in America. But, oh yeah, spirit of violence. Yeah, like the ones like you were doing all summer long. Riding and burning down cities and destroying everything. Bunch of, of Luciferian liberal hypocrites. Oops. Full screen again. Bunch of Luciferian hypocrites. I'll put it that way. Luciferian liberals. That sounds pretty good. Lucifer Luciferian liberals. Because they're a bunch of Illuminati Luciferian devils. We don't need white supremacists here. We don't need white supremacists here. We don't need white supremacists here. Black Lives Matter is a terrorist organization. Black Lives Matter is a terrorist organization. Black Lives Matter is a terrorist organization. Protests that are out here, the days that we have been out here, is to remember them. Yeah, I remember a stinking convicted pedophile. Now, that's all I'm gonna play because, quite frankly, this you get the picture. These Luciferian liberals are a bunch of of insane nutters who don't even understand the facts and hate the idea of self-defense and they hate the idea of personal accountability too for their actions. So we get to burn on cities and riot and destroy things all summer long. But oh, the people who are defending themselves, they're bringing a spirit of violence. Ridiculous. Just Luciferian liberal ridiculousness. So th just don't be deceived by all this Luciferian liberal nonsense. And again, I'm not left wing, I'm not right wing. I'm just stating the facts of reality right there. So anyway, don't be deceived by all this Luciferian Illuminati liberal insanity. By the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, be with all the brethren. Goodbye.